Good morning. Instead of combing my hair, I should use my fingers, water, oil, um, spray gel, or some type of cream to mow my hair or to style my hair. So first, water. Make sure that you put it all over your hand. Let you wash your hand. Spread it to the hair so you can calm the hair down. And never fight it. If it want to go some way, just kind of let it go and mold it into that direction. The next thing is oil. And you just tip over, have a little bit. That's it. Spread it all with your hand. Spread it out with your hand. And you go all over. Then I use a little bit of the spray gel. My hand again. And here I start molding. And I kind of like the shape a little bit. And then I start spray all over the hair. Now this is not hairspray, it's a gel, so you can spin it. When you think I just pinch it. And let me see the back. Okay. Nothing out of control. And if needed, add a little more water. Now you have water, gel, and spray. Then you shape the back. Anywhere you see a little frizziness, you can add a little bit of oil. Now this time it's only in your fingers. Pull just the top. Push it in the hair. And see how my size stick out? It's okay. Remember to go with the flow. Put a little spray gel in your fingers. Just let it stick out like that. Let's use the mirror. You still have the product in your hands, so use it. See, there you go. And every morning will be different, so I see you next morning. <laughs>
look at my hair. Asian hair, when you cut it short, it just go everywhere. And when you highlight, wow, you get a lot of frizz. These are frizz. If you don't have highlight, all you need is water, really. And then maybe a little bit spray gel or oil. But when you highlight your hair, you're gonna need a lot more. You need water, oil, <laughs> cream, or spray gel. Alrighty, so what the first thing we do? We're gonna put water in our hand. Same procedure at all time. And you know, like you wash your hand, you see that? I'm completely wet. What you do, I, I, I don't call this styling, I call this molding, okay? You push it into your hair. You need a little bit more water? Just a little bit for the bang. Around the edges. Oh, I forgot to show you what it looked like on the side in the back. So let's check this out. Okay, not too bad on the back, huh? And not too bad on the side. Alrighty, so next step, we're gonna do the oil. Any type of hair oil is fine. And kind of put lathers all over your hand. And then work it into your hair. The more frizzier your hair is, just add a little more, but this time at the fingertip. Work into the hair. And always go with the flow of your hair. So just think like this. Every morning you will have a different hairstyle. That's all. <laughs> okay, now, today is not too, too bad. So I'm gonna go lightly on a spray gel, okay? That's it. And then see which direction it want to go today. Ah, I look like it's want to go this side, kind of. In, mold it in. And one out. Another one. Stick out. And I twist the hair a lot. Because if you texturize your hair, you should be able to do this. And then it's frizzy, add a little more oil to it. You want to go into your side bang. Ah, that little thing. Okay, you want to stick out. Hmm? Okay, maybe I move this to the side. All right, see how your bang kind of pop out like that? Add a bit more water and calm it down. And pour it down. By now you have oil and spray gel you know, on your finger and your hand so you you actually have more control. See how I pinch and it go that way? And then I like it to stick out a little bit more here. Go back here. I use my finger. Okay, and this always stick out on my side. I just have one of the here that one go that way. So okay, that's fine. We're gonna Layer you out. And this side, same thing. And kind of play, let it just hang or go wherever it wanted to go. Okay, some there. Okay, anywhere that you don't want to see the frizz, 
just add oil to your fingers and then to pinch it down or you know you kind of twist it back and forth and come in down like that and see on this side I don't I think you can see right here there what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put a little spray gel in there and I'm gonna just pull it down pull it down and mold it with my finger now if you need to see a mural do so oh not bad not bad just a little section here when I separate it the same with your finger all right so if you like what you see then to keep it you can go with light hairspray or lightly with your spray gel and then just tame it out with your hand see how you use your fingers and your hand to mold the hair the way you want oh that little hair stick out right here see it push it in there then you know just spray a little bit on your finger and mold them in there you go so you go into that section this thing there you go voila well I also want to say something. I saw something at Team uh, Buddies. They sent me an email and it called Team C. I didn't know what it's all about, so I click on it. And it's so amazing because all the YouTube communities, all those who really care about environment, trees, and seas. Uh, so I click on it. And I was reading the spec and I click on the video and I watch them. It's really moving because all the people all over uh, different community, different continents, different country come together and want to clean up the sea because we have so many trash in the sea and uh, on it and in it because it sink down into the ocean. Imagine, I love fish, but if you go to a polluted river or ocean, would you want to eat the fish? Could you imagine what it does to your body? So, I, I participate in Team C. So, the link of two birdie is down there, uh, down here, and then the link for Team C is down here. They are raising funds to clean up the sea, and this is something I think is very important as any communities to participate. So I hope you click on the link, find out more about Team C, and if you are a beginner YouTuber or small YouTubers. Team Buddies is a fast way to grow your channel, if that's what you wanted. But the whole thing about Team Buddy, I love their search engine. And also, I love the way they make things very easy for you. I know a lot about Photoshop, but for other people, they don't know anything about how to create that thumbnail. TubeBuddy does have a way for you quickly make your thumbnail so that way you can just push the video out. Remember, I do my YouTube because I just love it. And uh, it's not a business, it's more of a, I would call them a passion or <laughs> a um, hobbies. And hobby and passion, I, I don't want to make it like a business. I want it. I do it when I can, and when I have something dearly that I want to share with you. So, please click on the link to Team, team C's and 
to Buddy. And thank you, Team Buddies, for sending me this email. I really appreciate it. See you all. Thank you, my subscribers.